Hi, thanks for joining me again. My name is Brenda Watson. I'm going to talk today about an article I read this morning in USA Today, and it was entitled, Opposing Camps Agree on Rewriting the Toxin Law. And this article was based on the news that the American Chemistry Council, which represents chemical manufacturers, and also regulate themselves, by the way, and environmental groups such as the Environmental Working Group agree that the current law governing toxins is badly broken and does not protect the public as it should. Well, thank goodness for that, because both sides agreed that this law called the Toxic Substances Control Act has not kept up with science and needs to be rewritten. The reason is the chemical companies do not have to test substances that they do not deem necessary to the damage of our health or the health of nature like our, like our animals. So it seems the EPA has used the law to ban or severely restrict only about six chemicals in the last 30 years. And what do they do? They make about a thousand new chemicals a year. So rewriting this law will give the EPA more money and power to ban dangerous substances. This, folks, is a big step forward. According to the American Chemistry Council's president, it is clear that many in the public, for a variety of reasons, do not hold a lot of confidence in the current system and that rewriting this law will help to restore confidence." End of quote. At least it's nice that he realizes every day the general public is growing more and more concerned with the devastating effects of all the chemicals in our environment and on our bodies and how this affects our bodies. How can you possibly have confidence in a system that allows some of the most dangerous toxic substances to be forced upon us and we have no control over it? And in the past, it has taken decades to get a toxic chemical out of the marketplace. So let's hope this new law will be more stringent and help protect both our environment and our health and the health of our children. Thank you for watching.